I guess that depends on what you mean by mainstream religion. That, that certainly doesn't seem to me to be true. I mean, usually the mainline denominations, uh, uh, Christian denominations, are thought to be things like Roman Catholicism, Church of England, or the Anglican Church, the Presbyterian Church, the United Church, and so forth. Certainly those churches don't char or aren't characterized by fundamentalism and don't, don't promote it. So fundamentalism, I think, would be a kind of a tiny segment of the broader Christian community of denominations. And I, I, I can't see that these churches do anything to support fundamentalism, if anything quite the contrary. So I guess I, I'm not persuaded of that at all. Um, I, in fact, I think that anyone who takes seriously the ethics of Jesus will be a champion of religious tolerance because Jesus taught us to not simply love our neighbors, but to love our enemies, to pray for those who persecute you and despitefully use you. So that someone who's following and committed to the ethic of Jesus will be a champion of freedom of thought and religious tolerance, and it would only be by acting inconsistently with the ethic of Jesus that someone would promote some sort of intolerant fundamentalism.